Well, hey guys, I'm here yet again with my friend Andrea. So I posted a picture on Instagram of all this crazy Japanese snack food and I was like, you know what? We're gonna test it out together, try out some interesting things. We can't even pronounce half of this. So sorry <laughs> in advance. We really admire your culture. We just can't pronounce things correctly. So without further ado, Let's get into our Japanese taste test. You ready for this? Since you said the word ordinary, the only thing I've wanted to say is, I guess it's ordinary, but I don't, I don't give, give a what. what. That was a big old shout out to our friend Ricky P. Dylan. You, you. Ricky P. Dylan. Dylan. There's a pause there. I don't think you guys all know that, but it's true. So starting off, I kind of made a little course for us. So oh. we can, yeah, we're gonna explore our taste buds and make an epic journey through Japanese culture. Wow. Um, okay. Yeah, I know it's pretty ambitious. Also, I know nothing about Japanese culture, so that doesn't help at all. First up, shrimp chips. Oh, it's terrifying. Yeah, these are like a fan favorite. Everyone I talked to said these are the bomb. Really? Which kind of scares me. I don't know how much I would like shrimp chips, but we're gonna find out. That was a bad idea. Wait, let me smell That was a really bad idea. Mm. Oh my God. <laughs> You know what it smells like? It smells like when you're on a boat in the ocean and there's fish. Does that happen to you a lot? Is that like a, mmm, the smell of the boat <laughs> fish? I think we got it. Oh, Just God. Ready? One, two, three. Not hey, bad. That's not bad at all. It tastes like um. I mean, I'm not gonna have another one, but you like, like these a lot. Great. <laughs> this is my new snack favorite, like go to. <laughs> Up next. I'm gonna keep eating my shrimp <laughs> We need something to kind of cleanse our palates throughout this. So I figured, you've already tried this before, but I have not. We are going to drink the Ramune? Ramune! Question mark. There's a little marble in them of some sort. Oh, and I have melon, by the way, which once again, fan favorite because I'm selfish. Let's do this. Oh, ah, woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. oh mine's exploding! Why, where? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Where? Where? I don't know what mine smells like. I'm scared. Wow, that's great. I was so right. It's like it? Sprite. Is, is it really? Sprite? Okay. No, good. Now to our entree. Every burger! And burger. And burger. I don't know. This was a Japanese food tasting, not a French one, so... Get it right, Andrea. <laughs> Amateur. I'm excited. Look at this happy packaging. A lot of burgers yelling things, which is great. Ugh. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Oh. They're like baby burgers. Baby burgers. So cute. Ready for this? I guess I am. <laughs> oh, wow. Wait. I'm, oh, I'm sorry. Wow. Oh, wow. That, that is really something. It's actually. No, it's actually really great. I'm gonna need to test it one more time. Oh, oh my god, I know exactly what this tastes like. Is it the cookies with the little elves in the houses that build People them? People are elf cookies. Yes! yes! Those are fantastic! Boom! Doesn't it taste exactly like that? Yes. It sounds like we're just really liking everything so far. I mean, maybe not you, mm -hmm. but I'm really enjoying this. Now moving on, we needed a little bit of fruit in our system. Uh, however, instead of actual fruit, how about candy fruit? I don't even know what these are called. I tried to look it up. I got you, I got you. They're called, no, you can try. I'm just gonna give you a second. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so that's... Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tried to look it up because I wanted to see if I could figure it out. And the only name that I could even remotely grab off of the internet was Pootit Kadamano? Okay. That sounds like something I want to put in my mouth. Put it in my mouth. <laughs> Whoa. What? Whoa. Whoa. What is that supposed to be? I can't tell if I like it or not. How do you describe this? It's like a stale marshmallow. Yeah. Clearly I kind of like it. <laughs> well, I keep eating it. I'm eating another one. Yeah. Here. Next up we have a super fun one. This is ramen crunch. Spicy. Whoa. Does it smell good? I, I'm excited. <laughs> Let me smell. I think it's just ramen. It's just ramen with like seasoning on it. Oh, that's good. Wait. Oh. oh okay. Wow. I see what you did there. Oh. Mm, ramen crunch. Spicy. I like it. Uh-huh. Wow, I like this Japanese store, and they're only a dollar thirty-nine. Look at that! Just the savings everywhere. All of the savings. Next up, we're taking a turn into the Weirdsville. Maybe this is super normal, and we just find it odd because this is what? Hmm? 
This is Botan or Botan rice I've candy. I've had these before. Have you really? Don't tell me. Well, I haven't had them before. I just bought them and opened the package and then I got scared so I didn't eat them. <laughs> but there's a sticker inside and I kept the sticker. <laughs> hey, you know where your priorities are and that's what's important. <laughs> this is some interesting candy that apparently is very common, uh, but we have never tried it before. Also, you know what's an interesting thing about this? It used to come with an actual toy inside, not a sticker. Oh, that's bull crap. I want a toy. I know. I feel a little bit hurt. You uh, feel lied to? I feel, I feel betrayed. I'm feeling really attacked right now. Oh, did you know that the wrapping right here is edible and it'll melt in your mouth? Let's get the full effect. Eat it. Really? Wait, what? Can I feel it? Wait, I'm so confused. It tastes like the equivalent of like a granny candy that you would have in America. You know what I mean? Like your grandmother would have these in a dish. Yeah, you're right. That's so right. It was like wrapper reception. There was one wrapper and then there's a second wrapper. And it was edible. Exactly. And then if Snoop Dogg ate it, it would be a wrapper eating a wrapper inside a wrapper. Oh. <laughs> Cheers. <sighs> now we have something that kind of scares me. Meiji black chocolate. Is that like cool. dark chocolate, but darker? Like really, really dark chocolate. Like it's just cocoa powder in a, in a sleeve. It just like falls out. Does that even look like dark chocolate to you? No. It kind of looks like milk. It smells like milk chocolate. It smells like hot chocolate. Whoa. Okay, yeah, we're done. <laughs> I want to apologize for that back there. <laughs> back Sorry. Earlier in the video, that was pretty embarrassing. Oh, I went for the whole thing. All right. Bottoms up. That was not as exciting as I thought it would be. Not at all. It's kind of just like standard milk chocolate. It's like a mixture between milk and dark chocolate. Uh huh. Like if you mix them together. Yeah. Dude, I really want to get the marble out. Calm down. I'm talking about a drink, not you. I'm like, Jesus, I just want the marble. It's all good. So good. So good. I got you. So our last thing on the menu is something I'm very excited about. It is called watering kiss mint. What does Which that mean? I have no clue. Oh, oh you wow. You took that to your nose so hard. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, that's apple already. Oh, what? Okay. That's really confusing. Ow. <laughs> Ow. It's really just like attacking my mouth. Yeah, it feels like it's like burning. It tastes kind of like the burn of Listerine. Right? The puzzle has been put together. Yeah, it has. So let us know down in the comments below if you've tried any of these things. We're pretty happy with most of them. We did a video over on Andrea's channel. I can't remember what it is right now, meaning we, I don't think we've thought of it. So, <laughs> but we will and it'll be there. Will, and it's gonna be great. Uh, so click on her face for a surprise delight video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Become a rosebud today. It's pretty spectacular. You can hang out in my garden anytime you want. Oh. Give this video a thumbs up. Go follow us on Twitter as well. Your Twitter is Andrea Russet. Yup, and mine is ArdenRose186 because someone stole my name. Anyways, <laughs> moving on. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you guys next time. Woo! Bye!